Subscribe to my channel Imam Salik. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Bismillahi wa salatu wa salamu ala Rasulillah. Amma ba'd. My respected brothers, sisters, honorable elders. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is so kareem, so rahim. As Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala also said in one of the hadith Qudsi, Inna rahmati wasi'at ghadabi. That my mercy is more than my anger, surrounding my anger. And look at the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that he granted us Ramadan. He granted us the last 10 nights of Ramadan. Then he granted us Eid al-Fitr. Then after the Eid al-Fitr, Alhamdulillah, that we are fortunate enough that we can ha could have Yawm Arafah, fasting of the Yawm Arafah, the day of Arafah. Then the Eid al-Adha. So what is the lesson out of these mercies? Allah is opening the doors every day, every night for me. What is my response? That is a question that I have to ask myself. That Allah is opening the doors. Allah granted me a chance that I came for Eid. I prayed Eid and the angels were standing there. They documented my name i finished completed my eid uh, then they announced the glad tidings from allah subhanahu wa ta'ala my name was also included in that list and they've been sent to allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to be forgiven and to be loved by allah subhanahu wa ta'ala so my brothers what is my response Allah is doing everything for me that I come back on the track. I come back on the, the commands of Allah and the sunnah of Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. So I leave every one of us tonight with this question that what is my response to all these mercies of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? Well, I am just looking for those occasions that yes, I will be good, but in my daily practical life, I put everything on my back and I am just following my desires, my wills, my style, and whatever I like to do, I am going ahead and doing that. So my brothers, let us think that what we are responding with to the love of Allah, to the mercies of Allah, to the opening of the doors, by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for accepting us and for giving us and to make us and to wait for us that we come back and be righteous and be pious and be one of those people they are beloved in the sight of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala let us think about this may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us understanding inshallah ameen